guys, I am at my sister's apartment right now. We got our coffee, woke up super early, and for those of you who don't know, my sister is getting married this summer, but she got her apartment, and so we're basically deep cleaning the shit out of it. We're gonna furnish everything, and it's going to be so bomb, because her sense of style is so close to mine, and I'm so excited, it's gonna look so good. But anyway, we're basically gonna go through everything, and deep clean everything, furnish everything, get everything looking really nice. And so it's ready and we're so excited, but I hope you guys enjoy it. Okay, but yeah, let's get started. It's around 9 p.m. right now. We spent the majority of the day cleaning basically. We had come here around 10 a.m. And then in between we went and just got some food and just basically refueled. Um, the living room is basically complete, which I am so happy about. I'll insert a clip here of what that looks like. But yeah, um, that's basically gonna wrap up my day. For today, I'm gonna continue tomorrow. It looks so homey and the style is so modern but cozy. It's really cool. But anyway, I will catch up with you guys later. Hey guys, so it's Sunday today and yesterday we ended up leaving the apartment around like 10ish or so um, and we're headed there right now to go meet up with my sister and her uh, fiance but I wanted to stop by at this place it's called Big Five Sporting Goods or something like that so long story short as some of you guys may know I'm really into lifting and I love going to the gym but I'm really trying to branch out and try new workouts you know and so um i want to try boxing and so i got boxing gloves which i'm so excited about and i'll show that to you guys a little bit later and i also got hand wraps i took a boxing class so i learned how to tie my hand wraps or whatever and now i am just here because i want to get punching mitts i think is what it's called and so i'm here to get that so i'm hoping i'm hoping that they have it and i also want to get jump ropes because um apparently boxing is a really good cardio workout and it's really good for your core and so i want to get jump ropes so that can be like the cardio in between the already cardio that we're doing with boxing i think it'd be super awesome so yeah i'm really excited i hope they have it So basically, I finished boxing and it was, holy shit, it was amazing. And I just want to show you guys what I got for boxing because if I feel like it might be useful. 
but anyway uh, let me start off with the mitts so these are the mitts that I told you guys I was trying to get from big five and so basically you wear them so let's assume I'm the person that's punching I can the other person can hold this I can punch these are awesome they're Everlast they were like $35 and I I like the color combination of them so got those and then sorry if it's loud I'm literally in the parking lot of a mall so but anyway these are the mitts that I ended up getting so they're just um, white and black Everlast boxing gloves okay but the reason I got them in black and white is because I got pink hand wraps so these are my hand wraps and I just think it looks so good together and I wanted to get something that would be very me so neutral and then a pop of pink so that's what I ended up getting I think it looks really cool and I got a jump rope because in between punching or as a warm-up or whatever um, for cardio I just got a jump rope and I feel like it'll be a good balance between punching and boxing and then cardio it's literally your full body your quads are engaged your core is engaged like you're you're moving your hips and your arms oh my god my shoulders are going to hurt so bad tomorrow and I was literally sweating I was sweating like a motherfucker but it was it was so awesome I'm so happy I did it but next time I'm for sure going to record it and I really like my pink hand wrap Good morning guys, so it has been a few days since I vlogged last and to be 100% honest with you, I've just been having like not the best week, you know, I mean I'm just, I'm, I'm really thankful like it could, things can be worse but they can be better, you know what I mean? So I just haven't vlogged in a little bit, um, a couple of days ago I went and got my nails done so that was awesome, I painted them. Well, it's like a dip and it's like this red and I really love it. A couple days before that, I went and got a facial, which was awesome. I am making it like an effort to get facials once a month just for preventative reasons and to keep my skin looking good. And so I got a collagen induction therapy facial slash a vampire facial and holy shit that thing hurts like a motherfucker apparently with vampire facials your skin starts bleeding and i when i looked in the mirror i was floored i'm like oh my god what did this lady do to my skin what the heck is happening like what did i get myself into because after a week or so your skin just looks a million times better than it did before and so today it's been around like five days and it's starting to look better anyway Today's a new day, it's going to be a good day. I am on my way to a cycling class with my best friend and I'm so excited. Basically, I joined Class Pass because I wanted to try something new during the evening with my best friend. I thought it would be really fun to try a bunch of new classes like yoga, Pilates, cycling, bar. But the theme for today is going to be Ariana Grande theme music, so I wanna see how they make that work, so I'm super excited about that. But yeah, that's kind of what's happening and then I'm gonna go to breakfast with my family. That's kind of it. I'm just gonna try to make it the best day possible and it's like situations like this where shit tears you down sometimes, like whether that be in your professional life, your personal life, your own mind is playing games on you and you're you're your own worst critic type of thing. It's just like just keep keep doing what you're doing, you know, like that's my thing moping around isn't gonna do anything for me and it's okay to be sad and it's okay to not feel your best like that is normal and I think that you should feel sad when you feel sad like don't not acknowledge those feelings but don't make those feelings take over your life you know what I mean so like this morning I could have moped around and just like Ugh, I, I just don't want to do life today but no, nah, I'm not gonna do that. Like I have, I have shit I wanna do, you know? And I'm not gonna have these feelings stop me from doing something that's going to make me feel better about myself, you know? So yeah, I'm on my way to a cycling class. I'm super excited and I will talk to you guys later. We just finished our recycling class. This is my best friend Samira, by Hi. the way. So it was so bomb. Yeah, it was, it was really intense. Right? Yeah, it was Ariana Grande themed, and we've Hence been to years. Yeah, that's so cute. <laughs> and we um, we we went to a cycling class before, but it wasn't themed, so we thought we'd try it out. It was really good. Yeah, it was so worth it. Yeah.
Hi, so basically I forgot to outro my vlog and I just stopped it in the middle of nowhere So that's totally my bad. So sorry about that. But basically, I, I need water But basically I had so much fun like I was feeling super down the past week and there's just been a lot of things going on professionally and you know Typically, I feel like, oh, it's totally okay. I got this. I can handle it. Like, it's no biggie. But when a bunch of things happen at one time, it's, like, a little bit discouraging. And I just felt so discouraged. And so that how I mentioned in the vlog earlier how I just needed to do something just keep life going hung out with my best friend the majority of the day and as you guys saw we went to the waterfront and we saw cherry blossoms and they were so beautiful oh my god they were literally epic and we ended up getting a really nice healthy salad afterward at garden bar and y'all know how I feel about garden bar I love that place so much and it really reminds you to stay grounded and just be humble and just enjoy the little things in life do you know what i mean because i feel like sometimes we're just like so caught up and like oh well this thing happened this thing happened or whatever it may be and we forget how important it is to cherish the small things do you know what i mean oh the lighting is a little whack oopsie but yes i am going to end this vlog here Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed our fast cleaning of my sister's new place. It was so much fun and it looks beautiful. After everything is finished, I do want to show you guys what it looks like because I feel like I'm emotionally invested at this point. But yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Bye!